Hey, what's up, Western? I'm David Mann, your sports reporter for the all-new Western TV. We are here at Agriplex Western Fair District for the Forest City Girls Roller Derby. Stay tuned for all the action coming up. Are your jammers? Here with the announcer of the roller derby himself, Lightning Slim. Lightning, how does this game work? Essentially, there are two jammers on the track. They're the ladies with the stars on their helmet. They're the ones who are able to score points. In front of them is a pack of blockers. It is the job of the blockers to stop the progress of the jammers. When the whistle blows, they begin to skate. The first jammer to emerge from the pack legally is declared the lead jammer. At that point, she may begin to score points. For each opposing player she passes, she will score a point. If she wants to, the lead jammer may place her hands on her hips and call off the jam. That's essentially how it works. There are some other subtleties involved, but that's, that's the basics. How do you score a Grand Slam? A Grand Slam is when the jammer scores the full five points available to her when she, pro when she passes all of the available blockers. I'm here with Bloodlust Barbie of the Timber Rollers. Bloodlust Barbie, you are a jammer? I am a jammer for the Timber Rollers, yes. What do you do? Uh, my job on the track is to get through the blockers who are trying to hit me down, and then oh, like, going around the lap, and then getting points as I pass an opposing blocker again without uh, falling down a gazillion times. <laughs> Why in the world do you do this sport? Because it's incredible. Uh, it's really, it's for everybody. It's uh, people of all sorts who come out and join roller derby. People who don't have any athletic background. Uh, for myself, I used to figure skate. So, and I, once I came to London, I didn't really have anything available for me as an adult. And when I found derby, that was, uh, it's just an incredible feeling to get on track with a whole bunch of women and getting sweaty and hitting hard and being competitive. It's really awesome. We're here now with Chris, Reformed Rebel, the ex-head referee at the Forest City Derby, Derby Girls. And Chris, what does it take to be a referee? Well, you, you have to have a really thick skin. You have to be really patient and understand that these girls are going to get angry. They're going to yell at you. And you just can't let them get to you. You can't show them the emotion. You just got to be stone-faced. Be be know the rules. Know what's going on. And keep up with the and put up. Well, that'll do it for the Roller Derby. Thanks to the Forest City Girls for putting this great event on. Until next time, I'm David Mann, your sports reporter for Western TV.